मेरा नाम अभिमन्यु अलसी सर है ये मेरा गांव है इसका नाम अलसी सर है मेरा फादर इनहेरिटेड मेन पैलेस ये 1630 में बना था इन 1757 के अंदर इट वाज कॉन्क्रीट बाय माय एंसेस्टर्स माय फादर ऑलवेज टेल्स मी यू आर नॉट द ओनर यू आर अ कस्टोडियन ऑफ द हाउस आप यहां पे सिर्फ इसको संभालने के लिए यहां बैठे हैं सो दैट यू कैन गिव इट टू द नेक्स्ट जनरेशन दैट्स व्हाट अलसी सर इज Now we run a hotel here, which is popularly known as El Cisar Mahal. Till 1954, when India became a democratic country and things started happening, that's when the Raj went away, and so all the powers were taken away. All most of the land was taken. यहाँ से कोई source की revenue ही नहीं बची थी. There's nothing at all because it's in the desert, so there's no farming. But Then in '94, this whole trend started of uh, making heritage hotels out of those palaces and mansions, and that's how it just kick-started. Again, back to its glory. Its Rolex is like a heirloom. It's always like it's always good to have an old Rolex in your wrist. So yeah, it's a, a submariner, and uh, I've got Al Cesar written behind, so it's etched. A L S I S A R. Me. I usually wear custom-made shoes, which are made for me. This is my small corner in the palace. I love everything what is there in this room. From cars to jeeps to weapons, lovely photographs, paintings, everything. Also, we also have a family tree here. Yeah, whatever weapons you see, they are from different era. I fell in love with weapons when. Uh, my father decided to give me the keys of the room and told me let's curate them let's restore them restoring and when you start restoring it that's when i gained so much knowledge about these things i usually love driving 4x4s i have a small little beautiful collection of vintage jeeps which are all of them are american jeeps one of them is a 1942 gpw the other one is a 1949 cj2a Which is a civilian jeep, and the third one is the 1953 M38 Avan. There are only there are only about 22 which were captured in the India-Pakistan War in 1965. Brand Jeep Cherokee gifted me this jeep, which is a 1944 Willys MB. This is a 1942 Ford Jeep. This one I have added a card to it, and I have made it into a bar in my office. The Front portion is in the lounge, which is dedicated to the Second World War. So the whole World War II lounge in, uh, has only old things, which I've displayed everywhere and made it look the way it looks now. जो झंडा आप महल के ऊपर देख रहे हो वो झंडा हमको राव शेखा जी से मिला था राव शेखा जी का राज होता था पूरी शेखावाटी एरिया पे। उसके ऊपर दो नीली पट्टियां देख रहे हो वो दो नीली पट्टियां इसलिए थी क्योंकि हमारी आर्मी में पठान होते थे तो उन पठानों को इज्जत देने के लिए इज्जत बख्शाने के लिए दो नीली ऊपर स्ट्रिप्स थे अगर मैं अलसीसर में हूँ तो रोज शाम को रन पे जाने के बाद जीप चलाने जरूर जाता हूँ वहां जाके जो सुकून मिलता है उसका अनुमान भी नहीं लगा सकते लोग 
वो अनुमान लगाने के लिए आपको अलसी से आना पड़ेगा also do a mag festival here which is called as magnetic fields first time i thought of doing a festival it was in 2013 jodhpur mein hota hai ye festival jiska naam hai i got influenced with the whole festival and somebody told me to do it and the somebody was mick jagger we were having a random conversation where he got to know about alsi sir and he told me that how far is it from delhi and i told him it's about 230 Oh, you should do a music festival there. That's when it clicked. Magnetic field is a really big deal for Al Caesar. What it has given to Al Caesar is unbelievable. The name and the fame, both. It is Al Caesar now is known all over the world because of magnetic fields. It's uh, it's one of the best. It's chosen among the one of the best festivals in the world now. People in this village feel proud that their village hosts a festival. I have tried to make this whole village benefit out of magnetic fields. Almost every single guy makes money out of magnetic fields. There is this employment which has been generated for all the villagers here in Alsace because of magnetic fields. I call myself Abhimanyu Alsace. Because there's only one. That's me.